Mount Makiling Forest Reserve in Los Baños, Laguna was declared an ASEAN Heritage Park in 2013. Every year, it welcomes an average of 120,000 visitors seeking a haven in nature. Thus, visitor management is vital for the forest reserve. Dr. Rogelio Andrada II, Professor at the College of Forestry and Natural Resources, University of the Philippines, Los Baños. Tourism has changed significantly since the pandemic hit the country. As people become more concerned about the social and environmental impacts of tourism, so too does the industry. Recognizing the need to regulate and maintain our ecotourism sites, we created this project. Nag-develop kami ng carrying capacity standards ng Mount Makiling Forest Reserve upang ma-regulate ang dami ng bumibisitang turista. Ang carrying capacity ay ang nire-recommendang bilang ng bisita sa isang ecotourism site upang mabalanse ang pagkakaroon ng kaaya-ayang recreational experience at visitor satisfaction habang sinisigurado na sustainable ang paggamit ng natural resources. We developed the carrying capacity standards using the procedure recommended by the DENR for protected areas. We used the Bullion's carrying capacity model to analyze and compute the carrying capacity values. Ang carrying capacity standards tulad ng sa Mount Makiling Forest Reserve ay nagsisilbing gabay ng mga tagapamahala sa kung paano mapapanatili ang kaayusan sa mga ecotourism areas. Sa pamamagitan din ng carrying capacity, matitiyak na mababawasan ang mga problema sa ecotourism sites tulad ng labis na pagkakalat, pagkasira ng mga kagamitan at ng kapaligiran pagsisiksikan ng mga tao at labis na paggamit ng likas yaman. The Mount Makiling Forest Reserve is an ecotourism destination that has sites and facilities that enable tourists to enjoy, appreciate, and learn about nature while providing a venue for physical and recreational activities that promote good health and well-being. As ecotourism is nature-based with natural resources as its main capital, a healthy and intact biodiversity are standards for ecotourism services to provide high-quality and meaningful experiences to visitors. This is why the government needs to protect its natural assets and capital. I am very proud of the carrying capacity standards that we were able to develop including the delineation and profiling of the ecotourism sites inside MMFR. I hope that through this program, we will establish and mainstream the use and application of carrying capacity standards in any tourism activity, not just ecotourism, so that problems and issues caused by over-tourism are lessened, if not eliminated. Sari buhay, sari buhay, sari buhay.